we're back. We're back from Comic-Con, which means it's time to get back into the swing of things. Um, I'm filming this Monday night, and I have barely even touched this all day. Um, I looked a little bit at this um, monthly, what's it called, like a monthly goal workbook thing from My Summer Touch. Link to her shop is down below. Um, I, I looked at that just to kind of plan out a little bit of video stuff and to jot down some numbers, but um, I don't think I even looked at my tracker today, and I definitely didn't even make a daily, because we got home super late last night, went straight to bed, had to get up early and go to work, um, and so that's what I'm doing today. I think I'm just going to be working off of a weekly, actually, this week. Um, as I try to get back into the swing of things and also maybe catch up on some of the things from my context list. So the weekly spread that I'm using this week is also from My Summer Touch. It is the vertical weekly uh, with foldouts. And so today's video, I see I have nothing here. Today's video I'm going to try to fill it out with data and then in tomorrow's video I'm going to decorate it because the house is still a wreck. My husband was home all day and he's been trying to tidy things up and unpack them. I was trying to help this evening. It's just, everything is just everywhere. You know how it is. You come back. We didn't get it completely clean before we left and then, um, you know, it's still not clean. So, let me see where we are here. I'm going to just use this as a, I don't think I'm going to use it as a tracker. I think I'm just going to use this as a little monthly. So anyway, I'm hoping that today's video will be quick-ish. We'll see if I find interesting things to talk about the entire time, then I won't have to even fast forward it and find interesting music. I hope you guys uh, have been good. I don't know if you missed me last week. It's a weird week and that like my weekend started on Wednesday. Which the, is the best. Having a long weekend. And then I get back to work and um, the internet apparently went out on Friday and still isn't back. Um, and so I was trying to get some stuff done offline. A couple things needed to be done online. And so they're <laughs> having us hook up to our own personal Wi-Fi tethering on our phones. Which is like, eh. I'm not sure how I feel about that because I don't have a company phone. All right, so there's dates and then I was going to use this for meals. Um, I'm not going to put a header on it yet just in case I want it to be decorative. Um, let me see, I, I sent my husband to the grocery store with a list and the baby ate it or something. So I'm going to try to remember what I put on there and in no particular order. See, I know chili was one, I think corned beef. Uh, I've got kielbasa and I don't, I don't remember. Ch yes, two things. Eh, if I if I remember, I feel like I put like six meals on there, but one of them may have been tonight's meal, which I don't have to put there because it's already going to be Tuesday. The idea here is that I can put like a, a letter for the day of the week in the first column and then check it off when it's done so I can kind of plan ahead. Um, see, I think, I don't know about tomorrow, but like Wednesday I think we're going to do the chili. Alright, then I believe up here is going to be an inspirational <laughs> quote that I've already picked out. Um, then I don't know what's going to go here. There's a lot of different interesting little spaces. Um, is there anything on my monthly that needs to get moved over? Braille Show Library. All right. So this side, this foldout is going to be events. It's interesting that um, there's definitely four spaces per day. Um, but they're not like delineated specifically. I think I'm going to probably put lines, but again, I don't want to do anything that might be considered decorative.
today just in case. Um, anyway, going to the library tomorrow. We always go on Tuesdays. And then Saturday afternoon is... Yeah, see, it's tricky because the, the number, I have to remember the number is above the day here. Saturday is going to be the bridal shower. I'm going to. Um, can look at that monthly. Is there anything on this side as to do? Uh, that's next week. We'll pay the mortgage next week. Um, then this section here is kind of delineated, this to-do list, but into six sections. So I guess I figure that's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, weekend, maybe. Um, so I'm going to put on here for tomorrow and to get the gift for the bridal shower. I had my eye on something off her registry and I hope it's not taken yet, but it probably is. This looks decorative. This I don't even know. Um, obviously all of the weeks with the timed hours, it's five um, boxes wide which I'm not really sure what to do with. But anyway, I'll probably just mark off like my hours at work. Maybe I'll just use a wider washi tape. Um, so I don't even know what other things I need to put on the list. I feel like I really just need to go through and like brain dump or something. Oh, I know what I need to do. I need to wash my bras. That won't be tomorrow. Maybe that'll be Wednesday. You probably can't even tell that there's like a slightly darker line between if every five lines here, um, which is probably fine because if it doesn't happen here, I don't have to rewrite it. It's just a list. Um, I feel like I had some ideas, but I don't really know how to implement them because of the whole tethering thing. Um, I've been tracking my data this month. Uh, I don't usually, I usually use an app called, I wanna say My Data Manager, it's for Android, and it has this persistent notification that tells you like how much of your data you've used this month and whether it's a behind or ahead of your schedule. Um, usually that's fine, but this month I was doing it differently because I wanted to save up a big chunk to use at Comic-Con. I didn't use all of what I had, like I saved a gig per day, which I knew I was never going to use, but it was it felt good to have that window and that cushion. But now I'm using some of that at work, maybe. So I'm wondering. One, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, four, four gigs this way. Yeah. So I've got like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Yes. Thursday's the, Thursday's the 25th. Okay. It's not even. I'm going to leave this blank for now. Uh, but what I'm going to do, I think, is... Yeah, I'm going to track my data, just kind of fill it in. But I don't know what color to fill it in with yet, because that's going to be determined by whatever theme I'm using for tomorrow's coloring session. Eh. See, I don't know. What can I do without a color scheme? This, I feel like, this has the, the two columns. So does this. So I could put, like, a day of the week in a checkbox next to these also. But I don't yet know if there's anything that I need to put there. Um, it's going to... Put the word context list here. I might cover that up with a sticker, the one of those important stickers, because that'll be like my goal for the week is to try to take things off of my context list. And then I think that's it for today. I'm just gonna leave that here. And 
and color it in tomorrow. So it looks very dull today, but this is enough to get me through tomorrow and then tomorrow night I will spend a little time, hopefully, that I can find to just make it look pretty so that I will be inspired to want to come back in and, and actually work in here because mostly I was just here. Gonna take a look real quick. I was just in this section, um, kind of crossing things off, using up a lot of this pretty birdie washi tape. Um, that's what Comic Con ended up looking like. Um, notes, notes, and notes, and spare paper. And then I showed you this briefly in the vlog, um, but it's just a little journal that like fits right here with no extra room to like fit. So we'll see if I want to keep that in there. I, I like it, but I haven't actually used it yet. So anyway, I'll see you tomorrow uh, when we'll get creative. If you have um, a vote for what color I should use for my theme for the next week, Leave that below because I currently have zero ideas. I'll see you then. Bye.